performing an identification by marking attributes. In this exercise, we will perform an identification of Canada thistle by saying that it has spiny leaves, wind-blown seeds, and rhizomes. These choices could be entered in any order. Note the line above the species list pane shows that there are currently 72 of 72 species remaining in the database. This shows that no species have been eliminated. Using one of the five methods of menu marking, mark the characteristic spines on leaves and or stems as yes. The number of species shown on the line above the species list is now 7 of 72. This means that of the original 72 species in this database, only 7 meet the criteria selected. The seven remaining species are shown in green with a check mark to their left and are alphabetized at the top of the species list. The eliminated species are shown in red-purple with a red X to their left and are alphabetized below the remaining species. Note, you can select whether the species are alphabetized by common or scientific name by clicking Options in the toolbar. Then select Species List Report and mark your selection. Click the small plus box to the left of Wind Dissemination. The Attribute menu opens and illustrations of the attributes appear in the right-hand pane. Using one of the five methods of menu marking, mark Fruit, Seed, or Spore Windborne as Yes. A message appears on the screen, Family Identified. This means that all species remaining in the database belong to the same plant family, in this case, Asteraceae. Click OK to clear the Family Identified message. Note the number of species remaining is now 4. Click the small box with the minus sign to the left of General to contract the menu. The next attribute which we will mark is Rhizomatous. Click the small plus box to the left of Root or Vegetative Propagule menu. Note that the attributes in this menu, which are not displayed by any of the remaining species, they have a frequency number of zero, are shown in gray, while those which are still applicable are shown in blue. Using one of the five methods of menu marking, mark Rhizomatous as Yes. A message saying, Species Identified, now appears on the screen and provides scrollable photos and a description of the plant on the right. Click OK to clear the Species Identified message. You can select whether the images are shown full screen or as thumbnails by toggling the thumbnail regular size icon on the toolbar. If the images are shown full size, you can scroll through the images. If the images are shown as thumbnails, you can click on any of the thumbnails to expand it to full size. Click the back button in the upper left to exit this view and return to the main screen. It is difficult to appreciate the power of the program when working with such a small database. In the broadleaf database of 1,000 weeds, the same three steps reduce the number of species remaining in the database to 70, then 21, and then 5 with the resulting Genus Identified message. Please watch the next video module titled, Using the Analyze feature to assist in identification.